Okay, we are live and we're recording. So that's great. Um, Did you turn my volume up, bro? No, I don't know how to, but hey, just speak louder. I'll turn mine down a little. Dun, dun. Wait, I need, I need music. I can't speak. <clears throat> Maybe when I want to add the other link, but anyway. Oh, yeah. Searching for music oh. for your next video? <clears throat> Then you need Here we go. I recommend City. Welcome everybody to the VS Gaming League. We got the Premier Division tonight. ATK Goon Squad versus DSG Gaming. First game one happening right now at this very moment. We got Lulu as our first ban. And Thresh. I am joined today by your one and only chicken boy once again mm -hmm. welcome welcome how uh, things going how are you looking forward to this match yo well this is uh, the premier league so to speak of the VS gaming so yeah I'm excited to see uh, how how the quality compares to to the last game that we were um, that we spectated and that we brought to you guys yeah, I think, uh, I mean, considering the last game that we did, um, the views, or oh, the last game that we spectated was the first division, and I mean, they, the team that we watched definitely did well um, in the first game. Second game, they <laughs> dominated once again, so it's going to be exciting. I wonder if it's going to be a, a closer matchup, or... If things are gonna be a little different, uh, I think uh, I wonder if there's gonna be more team fights and stuff like that. I'm gonna have to see, I suppose. But, well, um, I'm also, <coughs> I want to see if there's better, like not better, but uh, maybe a little bit less um, fighting, but a bit more controlled uh, laning phases. I feel like. In the other league, it was very much just in each other's faces all the time. That's true. Yeah, it was a lot of action, like all the time. Yeah. But um. You can see the picks. Yeah. The first pick. Into the so Ezreal. Too much surprise. Well, not into the Ezreal. Well, with the Ezreal. Ezreal response. <laughs> I think Ezreal is a good pick. He normally builds Blade of the Ring King, which. Uh, is a good counter for tanks. I mean, obviously, it does the damage on the amount of health they have. Poke lane. Very poke lane. And a good support lane. Uh, uh, if they can get the phase shift out from Ezreal early, I suppose the Orn ulti is definitely going to come in handy. Or I suppose they can use that as well to get the Ezreal phase shift out. There's the Graves. We did see it in the last game that we... Yeah. So that must be Graves Jungle. Probably looking at Orn Bot. I don't I know if they'll him. flex him into something like support or mid, but you never know. Yeah, I don't think that. Well, I say that, but I don't think many people play on middle. But mm. do you think they pick a support? Yeah, I think. I think they would rather go for a priority jungle. I feel like that would be better. But they have jungle. okay. There's the middle. Oh, they have jungle, sorry. Yeah. There's Andrew's the middle. That's true, that's true. Who do you Thieves think the following bands are going to be? That's a good well, question. 
Well, it depends on what they pick you. Okay, so they've gone for a jungler. So they're, so they're gonna probably ban ADCs or supports. I would think the Nautilus. Maybe a Leona. Yeah, probably an engaged support, yeah. Even a Thresh. Okay, the ADC ban. They've got Ezreal off, Twitch off, Virus off. Still a couple of, I mean, Misfortune's still open. She's a pretty high priority for most people. I wouldn't be surprised to see her if she's left open. Mordecai, yeah, this is looking like a on top lane. Soraka. Ben. Okay, so the Misfortune is open, so I'd expect um, ESG to pick up the Misfortune, because they have quite a... With the Orn, you're looking to team fight definitely. And with Scatter the Weak. Quite good. Yeah, I think Misfortune would work nicely. It depends on who they go with the support, but I think it will work. I wonder if I think we'll see a mid lane ban here. Maybe a top lane. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, nice okay. prediction. I wonder if they're gonna pick up the Wukong. The red side. Releasing in the jungle. Oh, there's the oh. Wukong, damn. Yeah, there we go. So, I wanna see Misfortune, and then they need someone to keep their carries alive. I think. The Sorok has been banned, the Lulu's been banned, Karma's been taken off, so maybe a Yana? I think they would pick up a ADC first. Yep, oh, well, this is both at the same time. Wow, I mean. <laughs> a would you go Rakan? I suppose you can. It's good engage. It Especially with the Orn and that, with the um, charm, I suppose. Uh, the, he's OT. Then uh, they would have a definitely good team fight, but Morgana's then they. Available. Oh, there it is, yeah. There's the Rakan, yeah. It's quite I mean, squishy, a, though, which yeah. is a thing. If the Wukong yeah. can get fed in the top lane. Ooh, really, huh? Mm, yeah, okay, wait, let's not get baited, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, the Galio can work. Let's see what they need. Okay. Okay, cool. So, going for the assassin. Yeah, I suppose that's to, to pick up the ADCs and stuff. It makes sense to get around the Orn. Um, yeah. They got the engage as well with the Jarvan. I mean, there's not much escape. The Graves can get over the wall, but the Syndra would be stuck. Uh, Zaya, I think, can use her OT if I'm not mistaken. To get over that OT. The Jars and Oof. the Cataclysm. Yeah, yeah. But I think both teams kind of have a very good team fight. A lot of engage, definitely. Yeah, but I think I think the, the big thing for me is just we actually had this jungle matchup in the last game that we that we brought uh, to to everyone watching uh, this Jarvan versus the Graves, and we saw the Jarvan had a huge impact on the lanes because of his ability to gank. The moment he has that flag and drag, whereas the Graves couldn't really do much, and uh, I feel like that's what um, put uh, the Javan's team ahead mm, was they just snowballed true. that early laning phase. So I'm, I want to see how these guys handle the Javan jungle. I want to see them ward, play safe. Yeah, I feel you on that one definitely. But I, I also think the situation might be a little bit different with regards to the Javan and the Wukong, because I mean the Javan kind of snowboard the Wukong on the top lane where Orn's quite a tanky guy. I mean the Urgot was quite tanky. But I mean mostly Orn, especially with the this squad he's probably gonna build a Sunfire kick first. Yeah. And then definitely go into the um Abyssal Mask. Yeah, but, probably. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it's still, but what I mean is like, in the mid lane, the Syndra needs to be careful because Jarvan definitely wants to try mm. and lock her up, she mm. doesn't have any escape. Bot lane Zaya without her ulti doesn't have any escape, but there's definitely gank potential for the Jarvan, and, and that's, yeah, I want to see that the, I mean, Orn, yeah, I mean, we say he's tanky, and he is, but early game, everyone's fairly squishy. Wukong and Jarvan, it's, it's a lot of damage. We never know. It's a pity we can't see the summoner spells. I'll be curious to see what Syndra's taking. If she's going to take a barrier or a heal or she's well, going to go aggressive with the ignite. Yeah, we'll have to see when the, the screen loads. But I think also what uh, might be critical in the bot lane is that there's quite a bit of engage um, with the Recon. But if he does miss his uh, knockup, then the Karma could turn it around with a bind or with yeah. a link. 
he's going to eat so much damage. But he does have the, I mean, he does have the hop back to an, the extended range with the Zaya um, comp, that Zaya Rakan partnership. There's is the extended range on the shield, which will help them in lane definitely. I and think I with expect the, the Karma ulti. and the Ezreal to push early, early levels definitely. Um, with the those Qs, just spamming out those Qs, trying to keep, trying to deny Zaya from farming. Um, yeah, so because I mean, yes, as much as the Rakan has the engage, I don't, I don't know if they have the damage. I really think ATK, you know, the Ezreal and the Karma have more damage than the Zaya and the Rakan. So if Rakan's going to look for plays, I think they need Graves there to bring some extra damage. Mm. Yeah, especially with the Karma shield, it's going to be. A tricky one. Yeah, and there's slows, Israel's E as you've mentioned, his phase. I mean it's yeah, I think it's gonna be a tough lane. Maybe it's gonna be interesting as well for the Echo to see if he pushes out the lane and tries to roam and maybe gank somewhere as well. Be able to push out the lane against the Syndra. I think Syndra has um, better wave clear, especially early. Echo's gonna need like mm. three levels into his Q with probably more than just a corrupting potion, which is probably what he's going to start with to be able to push out the lane against the Syndra. I expect him to be pushed in early at least. We and that's why I say it's see. dangerous for the Syndra because if she does push it in and she doesn't ward, I'll just going to go to Yeah. That's for sure. Let's see on the summoner spells and uh, <coughs> masteries or runes, I suppose. What do you call it? TP. Masteries and runes? <laughs> TP on both mid laners and top laners. Mm. Okay. There's a heal and ignite on the Ooh. bot lane. Ooh, Ezreal took exhaust, exhaust there. Yeah. <laughs> on the bot lane. Yeah, okay. Grace, obviously, that's the standard. Phase Rush, Conqueror, yeah, those look right. Hail of Blades on the Echo is a bit different. Normally, they take about an Electrocute or something yeah. like that. So, the Hail of Blades might be, is definitely a different route. A lethal Tempo. With the Conqueror, yeah, everything else kind of looks standard, basically. Nothing too different. We've got ooh, four skins to five skins. Ooh, is that going to make a difference? Is that the no. deciding factor? <laughs> no, we have, we have five against three. This oh, Rikon doesn't have a skin. Have eyes. Rikon, uh, looked like he had a skin there. Okay, oh. let me just... Uh, where are we going? We're gonna start with the. Okay, okay. Just loading up here. We can look at the lovely rift that is League of Legends. Where are the blue team loading in? Are you in? Yep. And the red team loading in. You think they're gonna be any invades at all? It looks like Jarvan wants to go towards his red, maybe the enemy blue. Ooh, what's your yeah, time there? Yeah, we then? saw this yesterday. 20, 21, Yeah, 22. okay. We're almost yeah. same. Just, uh... Mm -hmm. I don't know if he's just gonna ward. Ooh, oh, yeah, comes the... Uh, nope, he turns around. Oh. Mid lane yeah. sees. Let's see. So we have just a... Oh, there, Grave spots the Jarvan. And... What well, Jarvan hasn't spotted him. Echo spots the Syndra. But we see a... Definitely, Israel chilling in the bush there. Horns on the Doran's blade with the potion. Okay, so Graves went back. He put down a ward and he went back to go get his sweeper, and he's going to his blue. Red. So Jar and ah, oh, he's red. Yes, sorry. <laughs> and then Jarvan is also starting on his red. So they'll be on opposite sides. So I think Jarvan might be going for the level three gank in the bot lane. Uh, in the bot lane first. Is he gonna get anything? Well, I mean, anything could change, but uh, that makes sense. Okay, so we're gonna get yeah, that. I think. Yeah. Yeah. Look, look at Israel and Tom's positioning as well. I think they want to push this lane hard oh, and get the level two legs, first. Spike for me. What's your time there? Uh, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty. Okay. Ooh, Karma poke onto yeah. the Zaya right in the beginning with the Ezreal as well. That's how you Definitely putting. Oh, hit both of them. 
There's a lot of pressure in this lane. We're gonna be watching this lane a bit. Middle. Lane. Yeah. I think keep your eye on bot lane. Ugh, another nice place, place right? <laughs> what are you on? Two or four. Okay, two or six, two or seven. Okay, uh, Graves went is going for the blue invade. Oh, he's not gonna get there in time. He's not gonna, gonna see it. Oh, we're gonna have our first fight. No. no. Okay, well played. Well played. Just sir. uh oh, but here comes the collapse. With the echo coming down and the karma. Uh, there it flash. Yes. Oh, yeah, oh first dead. blood on the karma oh, with the ignite. Scum, bad support. Graves. The with the flash, but the echo, nice uh, counter jungling coming in from the Jarvan, and the echo is kind of back to the poke in the top lane. Mm. Karma flashed as well for that. Nah, it'll just be a bit of poke. I don't think anyone will get a kill. In the top lane, yeah, they yeah. kind of trading back and forth. Nothing too crazy. Um, oh, so it's two flashes on red side for the one flash on blue side. But they did but get I the mean, first, first blood. blood. Yep. Um, but Karma didn't even use the ignite. I thought maybe the ignite got a good kill. There goes the Wukong into the jungle to see where the Graze is. He's gonna check for the blue. He's gonna oh, find it, and there's he... no smite. Didn't oh, take it. He did get smite. the smite. Yeah. Uh, oh, in the okay. mid lane. Nope. Nothing. He has to run away He's now chasing. Though. Yeah. So Graze is gonna take top scuttle. Jarvan's gonna take bottom. A lot of pressure in the bot lane, trying to take these. Uh, plates. <laughs> Yo. His legs got hacked. Yeah, I mean, I he, we played it. a game earlier and we were having some trouble with the server. Yeah, I hope they not. Yeah, so I hope for their sake, yeah, they're not. I haven't seen any pauses or anything coming, so I think they're fine. Doesn't look. Oh, that CS difference is growing in the bot lane for sure. Here's the Jarvan for the possible <coughs> tower dive, but I don't think he will. Nope. I think he's just there for the counter, the potential for counter gank. Yeah. Yeah, this is what I expected. Karma and Ezreal to push them in hard and to bully with their poke. I'm really not surprised to see this. And that's why I'm a little bit surprised to see the Rokan. I, I would have thought they would want a bit more sustain. I mean, look at that. He's gonna have to go back. The Rokan's almost useless in this. Yeah. There's nothing you can do to keep this uh, Zaya safe. The body block? Nope. Okay, so Ezreal is just going to be taking some plates. Um, a bit of bullying in the top lane, it's but we mirrored, but it's just do see the Orn pushing. He does yeah, have the Ruby Crystal. Oh, here he comes a pushed, he's gonna push gank from Graves, maybe? Nah. Echo doesn't have a flash, but yeah, it's it does have the dash, though. Ninja doesn't have much mana. Ooh, they're pinging on the mana. Infernal Drake. Great well, they just... have the pressure, but they're resetting. I think that's a good call, so Israel can get his tier. Get oh, no, he's getting Sheen, Sheen, actually. So they're going all out for the damage and the poke. Yeah. Yeah, why not? I mean, they're winning this lane hard. Makes sense. Mid he might... Yep, I see it. He might even get the Trinity Force instead of the Iceborne Gauntlet. Ooh, we'll have to see. Mm. Yeah, he might, eh? And they're taking Drake on the blue team. Blue te oh Early pressure, he's gonna... Oh, that is very close. If they come for this gank, they're standing right next to each other. Graves is uh, taking the damage, but they're gonna get it. Yep. Well done. Graves is gonna go back. He just had a ruby crystal last time I checked. Yep. Yeah, so I think he's gonna upgrade that into the Sunfire, into the Cinderhawk for the, yeah, for yeah. the Sunfire cap. Makes sense. It. Bot lane, what did Karma get? She got, she's building towards the chalice. chalice. Okay. Sure, so she good. really just wants to spam these Qs. Well, there she goes. Yeah, that, that's how you play this matchup. Oh, she missed the Q? No, she got the bind though, but she did... Oh, they did do some... Oh, he dodged the... Stun from the... The Q from the Israel missed. The Q from the Karma misses as well. The feathers, yeah. but here comes the job and Graves. <laughs> Oh, he turns it around, but he has the echo. Oh, in the jungle. He dash. Echo. Oh, he misses the EQ. TP. In TP. No, it's interrupted oh, it's by gonna Wukong's LT, so uh -huh. the top lane is coming in. Okay. Um, they're collapsing there in the tri bush. Oh, great get of the week. This might be. F oh no, echo still has his LT. I think. Yeah, it's fine. gonna be fine. Yeah. Yeah. Well played by the Wukong. So no stun. No, no LT on the Wukong, and no TP on the Orn. Yeah, we'll, we'll Ooh, here comes the... 
I've got an 18 lead on the Israel. Oh, oh my that goodness. That side is going to have to go back again. Yeah. Here comes the Graves. Was that yep. healthy? No, no. From the Graves? No. No, just the, just the W. Wukong looks like he's going to go back and just TP for the reset. Let's see what he buys. What do you think he's going to go into? The phage? Oh, no, he's actually sticking around. I wonder if we'll see the Blade of the Rune King first, like we saw the other, uh, day. The other day. Oh, mid lane. It was a bit low. He oh, does have his watching. ulti, though. Bot lane, oh my goodness. Sentra has lane. his ulti as well, so... Yeah. If he can get the stun, it will definitely... Yeah, but look at his mana. No, true. I'm just Doesn't saying, if he can... Combo. Okay, Echo... No. Nah, he won't. Wukong... He's still sticking around. Hasn't decided to go back. I'm sure the one's gonna go... Oh, he's building that? Cinder Hulk, there it is. Yep. There it is. Oh, Bammy Cinder. Bammy Cinder. Yeah, that's the Cinder is so recalling. Wukong's oh. got a bit of a lead. Mid's even, and then yeah, Bot is still a 20 CS lead. Yeah. But, Ezreal's come back with... Oh no, he's going towards that gauntlet. The frozen gauntlet, yeah. Yeah, alright. Unless he wants to go mirror mana with the tier, but I don't think so. It's possible. Ooh, tether. Into a Q. Oh, you're ahead of me now. Zaya has a... Okay, there's a heal. There's an ulti from the Rakan. Oh my goodness, okay. Ezreal's yeah, Ezreal, gonna... So support versus support. We have a tether. Uh, but here comes top lane. Oh, there's gonna be a dead support. Yeah. Oh, flash! Oh, oh he's gonna. Oh, he's under the nice. tower. Okay, well played. You got the it. TP from the Wukong. So that puts a two for one in favor of red side. And they're taking Rift Herald. What's your time there? Uh, oh, 58, 59, 9. Yeah, so Rift Herald for blue. This is going to be bot turret for red, but I think it's right for to shift towards top side of the map. They, there's nothing they can do here. I want the, record, the desire to back off as well. There's absolutely nothing she can do. There we go. Took the tower. Oh, oh my the OT. There's no mana. Oh, the slow. There comes oh, the Rukon to turn around. The yeah. That's it. Ooh, Echo in the mid lane. Oh, are you watching oh she misses Scatter the Weak. Okay, but she's fine. Yeah, reset from red on the blue side. It looks like the Wukong is either going for the Triforce or the Black Cleaver. Yeah, looks it like looks the Black like Cleaver. Cleaver. Yeah. I suppose it makes sense because of how tanky the Orn's going to be. Um, Jarvan's going for the tanky build. Grave's got the Skirmisher. Yeah. Syndra. Hmm. Yeah, Jarvan has to go tanky because he's the, he's the only Engaged. set that's a tank. Yeah. Ezreal is going for the Mana Mune first. Yeah, so that that uh, Sheen might still turn into a Trinity Force. Yeah, it's possible. Or it could turn into the Gauntlet still. Yeah, so we'll keep our eye on that. Um, I mean, I don't think there's anyone that he really needs to kite. That's, uh, that's know, what I was... Israel, so yeah, that's why I was yeah, thinking he should go it. the Triforce. Yeah. And cool. Power Q, here comes for the... Oh. There's a tier that's gonna land. Ulti onto the karma. Flash the down. Weak, weak misses, yeah. Uh, oh, Ezreal gets, gets it, yeah. Ulti out of the Zion. Oh, here oh, comes the Echo. Dead. Oh. EQ, the EWQ combo. And Wukong still top taking, or pushing the wave, so that's good. They, it looks like they're gonna get turret. Graves looks like, oh, the stop oh, recall. Graves is here, but it doesn't look like he's gonna... Oh, Echo's going for the trade, it looks like he might die. Ulti's out, almost kills him. Oh and they get the Drake. Oh, he's gonna try to go for it still. Yeah. Oh, Flash E dead. Ooh, oh. nope. <laughs> Turn around, there goes the... Yeah. Jarvan looks like he's farming. The Drake had no reason to stay there. He was never gonna contest that. Uh, it's, it's first Drake. Yeah, nothing will happen there. Big fight in right. the top lane! No. Yeah. <laughs> Only counts. Get out of the weak lands mid, but Syndra yeah. has no damage. Yeah, Not enough isn't. damage. Oh, there's the poke again. Oh, I think the Karma Q does more damage than the Syndra <laughs> Q. <laughs> <laughs> See, Karma's already finished her Unholy Grail, her Athenes. That's 
advantage of that early what are we, we're looking at one play to six at the moment so wow that's definitely quite a, a big goal and first lead turret. and first turret oh and first turret yeah we're we looking at basically a oh here goal comes the own ot hits the that's karma, karma. that's a, yes can the israel get the out he does Ooh, get he the knock up flash and they oh, he's off. gonna get out yeah Oh, they're they chasing the Echo. Oh, Echo got the Zai on the backside. I didn't see that. Oh, wow, that was a mistake. Must have gone around the bushes. Ooh, Jarvan's looking for the engage. No, not gonna happen. Has, uh, Rift Herald hasn't been used yet. It's running out of time. Uh, it's got about 10 seconds to pop that Herald before yes, it expires. On the graves. It the might graves, yeah. go bottom with it now. With the push. They spotted there by a ward. The echo is going to catch this well. wave. I think it's going to be dropped here. Yeah. Yep, there it comes. But, but the wave no is gone. Creeps here. Oh, that's the problem. Lovely lag spike. Oh, I didn't get one. I'm on 1306. Seven. I'm behind again. Uh, eight, nine, ten, no, eleven, <laughs> thirteen, Two fourteen. Two plates in the bot lane. Would yep. it be three? Yes. Yes. Ah, you're ahead of me. Okay, they're pushing middle there. Okay, middle, Zaya has no... Okay, Flash is coming up, and her ult is coming up. She should like be okay. She's trying to go for that... Oh, there's a leg Oof. spike. Do you get one too? Oh, they, there's a fight. ADC versus ADC. Oh, yeah. oh Exhaust. Flash. Okay, good Flash. Oh. But the Graves is dead. Yeah. Uh, Ooh, here comes the OT on the Rakan. Flash down on the Jarvan. Ezreal's poking with those Q still. Ooh, Echo's engaging again, but uh, Ezreal just continues to poke. They gotta do something about that. Echo has his ulti. I think he's gonna try and dive and then ulti out just to do some damage. Right, yeah, here it comes. Here it comes. Can they catch yep. someone? Yep. Oh, on one. the Zaya. Oh. Fall as well. Two. Like no, oh, yes, Echo's no. got an ulti. Oh Oh, Wukong gets taken down by the tower, and Echo gets taken down by the tower as well. Yes. <laughs> Damn, yeah, yeah, oh. just... Okay, oh, so, so close to that kill on the orb. What happened? We have three deaths on blue side and two deaths on red side, so still yep. even. Exhaust down on the Ezreal, Flash down on the Echo, and Wukong and Yo, Jarvan. I think it's easier to say who has. So <laughs> red has Flash. Oh, I was looking at red side. <laughs> and blue... Uh, Rukan has ignite. That's it. All other summoners. Are down. Israel has flash. On the red side, Israel has flash. Yes. All other summoners are down. Wukong has true. TP. Okay, let's see. Item wise, we got Wukong with the black cleaver and the life steal. Israel still got that sheen, but he is sitting on 1,100 gold. He's got the uh, the mirror mana. Cinder. I think she's trying to go for the Luden's echo, but yes. I'm not yeah. too sure what that blasting wand is for. Morello's no, maybe? No, no, it's for the Lumen's Echo. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, it's last chapter plus blasting one plus 1050 gold. Okay. Graves yeah. still sitting on the, just the jungling item as well as the Jarvan. Uh, completed boots on the Jarvan there. Um, yeah, we're Kong bot lane, kind of pushing there, trying to hold the Zaya, but nothing much. Ezreal in the middle. We do see about a 6,000 gold lead there. 280k. Control for red around Rift Herald, and they're gonna just take that Rift Herald. Just look at some vision, vision control here. Yeah. <laughs> blue side, yeah. oof, there's not a lot of wards on the map. They've got their blue jungle. No oh, blue Echo's buff, killing the Graves. Can you yeah, get the kill? Oh, oh flash. flash away. Oh, Cinder died there. In that meantime. Oh, and oh. Rift being summoned in the mid lane. Yep. Israel ult in the mid lane as well to push everyone off the turret. This turret is gonna fall. Wukong's taking Dragon in the meantime on the backside for a Cloud Soul. Cloud Soul. Here comes the team to join him. Where Echo is going to go top to push this way now. The wave out. Echo is just farming. Oof, Yo, that farm difference. I was just about to say that. That farm Israel difference on the Israel. Yeah. 
He's sitting on about two and a half thousand gold. So uh, he does need to go back there, but there's a three thousand gold difference between the ADCs at the moment. Here comes the recon for the possible gank with the graves. How do you see the gold? Uh, push X. Um, Zai's in the mid lane trying to catch up on that CS. Uh, Echo's gonna reset. Let's see what he buys with the 1300. It looks like a Lich Bane he's going for. Yes, completes boots. Wukong's actually going for. It's Dance. Yes, it is Death Dance. You are correct. I thought it was Aegis of the Legion, but it no. is not. No, that's, yeah, that's a Death Dance. It's very different build to what we saw the other night with the Trinity Force and the Blade of the Rune King, but mm. yeah. I think it's also, I Playing suppose, a bit safer. the only person he really needs to get through is the Orn with the Blade of the Rune King, so it's not necessary for the rest of the squad. He's just catching some farm in the top lane. Um, oh no, let's look at some vision. They only had this ward over here, the blue side, and the one right in the tri bush. Red has a very deep ward over here. Invading. Put another ward by the blue. Echo in the bot lane. Ooh, There's a five the and a half thousand gold lead coming out of the bot lane. The these two, yeah, they oh. can't match against each other. They need to send the Zyra Khan to the opposite side of where everything is really. <laughs> One's gonna get away. I think top turret's gonna fall for blue. The echo is hanging around. Can he get caught by the Syndra? He gets the sh Ooh, scatter of the week, but the there goes in. Oh, uh, out! No, yeah, we're not gonna problem. get it. Yeah. Bad Gauti is down though. For now. For now. I don't think it can be punished though. But look at this Ezreal's cues, man. He's just queuing. You see, they get the frozen gauntlet in the end. Okay. It looks. Not too sure what he's going for on that. Essence Reaver? Oh, he's gonna kill the Zaya one on one. Almost. OT? Oh, dodged by the Zaya. Almost oh, killed the Recon. Oh, Zaya dodges the Israel OT. No, I think he'll be behind lane. me. Yeah. yeah. 19, 27, 28, 29. Okay. Okay, okay, and what do we got? Oh, Kong's pushing. How much health is that? I can't see. 146. <laughs> Ooh, Kama's tethered the horn, but he used the breath, the willow's breath or whatever it's Bellow's called. <laughs> to stop the pushing on the top lane, and the Ezreal was just poking from the side. Um, I think they just, yeah, hitting a 3-1-3, at the moment. The poke is just... Oh my goodness, Absurdly it's so annoying. Absurdly annoying, yeah. <laughs> oh. You see that Ezreal just chasing the oil. Echoes... Oh, he did, didn't recall in the end. Yeah, he's well. getting some more farm. Uh, Sinner and them are moving down, but... I don't think anyone can answer there the Echoes is split push. Absolutely no vision besides the one in the bot lane by the tribe force. Right. Ooh, yeah, get of the weak misses, and they take the tower on the top lane. Welcome to all our viewers, hope you guys are enjoying, we're watching the ATK DSG game, game 1, so you're not too far. The um, first game that we're bringing you guys from the Premier League mm. in South Africa. Let's see, everybody went back, Wukong got the death dance, um, Jarvan is going for oh, sold something. Black Cleaver looks like it, yes, mm. I think it would be the Black yeah. Cleaver. Yeah, must be. Ezreal is going for the Death Dance as well? Yeah. That's okay, that's very different sure. on the Ezreal. Yeah. With the, that in conjunction with the Conqueror, he's just going to have so much sustain. Oh, my as well as cooldown reduction. I think that's what the biggest thing is. Um, yeah, if you guys are watching the game, let us know who you think is going to take this first game. Um, mm -hmm. Besides Raz Kals. She's already. Ooh, fight happening. OT. Jarvan is going to get out, but the poke sways him. Oh, he goes back in for the re engage the OT. Here comes the Wukong on the backside with his OT. Gets a four man knockup. 
a double knockup again. Israel is just cleaning up shop shop on the back side, and that's a f ace for ATK. Do you think they push for the win? They I might actually. They might as well. Um, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think the timers are what 17 seconds on the Rakan. Yeah, and the bot lane is 16. Weak, so mm, maybe not. They can stop them. I oh, think they're gonna go for try it for it. Yeah, they're gonna. Yeah, here it goes. Yeah, it's I gonna be game true. one. Ooh, flash <laughs> by the karma <laughs> to get out of turret range. Oh, she takes the yeah, Pushing, she but yeah, there's GG. the Azure sure. OT and the TP just as well an insult. Well played, ATK. So let's see, yeah. 7, 1, and 5 on the Azure. 1 and 5 on the Zaya. I'm just yeah, going through some stats. One, 5 for 1 on the Wukong. Jarvan didn't get many kills, but he definitely helped with those assists. Yeah. <laughs> 13 out of the 17. I think that's pretty good participation there. Israel got 12 po kill participation out of the... Th uh, uh, 13 on the Karma. Yeah, out of the 17. Definitely an uh, all-round team effort. Braz Culls was right on the first game prediction. She did predict ATK is going to win this one. So, but yeah, look on... Didn't get the come a second item completed. Um, yeah, it's basically one item across the board, unfortunately. But that does come from a fourteen thousand gold difference. So yeah, definitely the poke com coming out. Seventy CS lead on the Azure. Very interesting game. Very uh, close one as well. I don't know, was it? I don't think so. I to think be it was. To be completely honest, um, or just in terms of objective control, I mean, yes, blue team took the first Drake and yes. they took the first Herald, but I don't think they took <clears> a single turret. No, they didn't. They did get those two plates down on the bot lane, but um. Yeah, but you don't win a game by taking two plates. <laughs> True, you don't. But I think the they they did have a good uh, early game. I mean, the, the Graves invade, I think, kind of. Set them back a little with the flash, and then the first blood on the karma. The blood, yeah. And I think that just escalated the bot lane's poke to even more um, just annoyance, kind of not being able to really do anything. Um, yeah, it's it's going to be an interesting second game. I think we're just going to have a break. Uh, you guys can stick around. We're just going to be. I suppose talking about the first game so far. Um, so, yeah, I think the first thing, are we going to see any different bands, picks and bands? We saw in our last game that we cast, we saw they got punished by a Wukong that they chose not to ban. I, I said they should have, they didn't, and it cost them, I think. But do you think that might have just been because of the performance by the first game? That we expect that we shall cast it and the Wukong there, or just the fact that Wukong is a broken champion at the moment? No, so <laughs> that's my point. He's, he's a broken champion. They didn't ban him. They played against him and lost, and they chose not to ban him or to first pick him when they had the chance either. And that I think was a mistake. So what I'm saying is but they, tonight, what? So I'm not. I'm not talking about a Wukong ban now. What I'm saying is. Is there anything you think DSG needs to ban or take away from the ATK? Do they need to take the Echo away? Do they need to take the Ezreal or the Karma oh. away? I think you only need to take one of those two away for... You know, you don't have to, If you take the Ezreal away, you're probably not going to see Karma paired up with anybody else. Most likely, but uh, for me, I would rather ban the Karma and leave the Ezreal as a, as a, as a pick. Um, I feel like Karma's utility is more dangerous than the Azure ADC capabilities. Um, yeah, I think they can maybe ban the Wukong. I feel like he... Yeah, he didn't have much of an early game, which is expected against the Orn. But, I mean, he had that four-man ulti uh, in the jungle by their blue side, which definitely turned the fight. That fight. Um, and Azure just was able to clean up afterwards. So I think they might ban the Wukong after that. But, man, it's it's tricky to say in this... Because do they also ban the Echo as well? That's... Um... Yeah, I don't know if they need to ban the Echo on the first round. I think if they haven't picked him in the first phase, um, they can definitely ban him 
uh, on the second phase. Um, but I think if uh, you know, I don't. I just think the DSG wasn't expecting the Echo to be picked into the Syndra. I think maybe uh, DSG will save their mid lane ban, ah, their mid lane pick for after ATK's pick this time. Yeah, that is true. They kind of. Uh, game two over here. We are live still. About to go into game two. Just about ready. Um. Yeah, it seems like everybody's in one more. There we go. I wonder if they... Uh, it doesn't look like they're going to have a break. So, probably just jump straight into the action once again. It sounds like it. Yep. <laughs> Answering for the teams. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. Uh, what if... Uh, yeah, everyone's ready. Yeah, looks like start. it. Uh, I don't think... Okay, so ATK have first pick this time. Oh. Okay, let's see the bands. If Razkal's still with us, uh, I'm guessing your prediction is still ATK for the second well, game. Well, if, if, it, if it isn't <laughs> after that game, I'd be very curious. So, so, uh, well, she, uh, she's also the girlfriend of the jungler, I think it is. You yes. Of... Okay. Of ATK's, yeah, jungle and oh, neutron. So she's biased. So she's biased, yes. So. Oh, <laughs> yo, yo. But I mean, um, oh. Okay. Uh, no, a zero ban. ban. I think that might have been a mistake. Let's see if they want to remake. Oh. We can't is it just see the a chat. trick? Yeah, we can't see the chat at the moment, unfortunately. But. Yeah. Well, carrying okay. on as usual. Maybe they just didn't. Think of, or maybe they didn't have time. We'll see on this one. If there's definitely not a double no ban, then surely something must be wrong. Yeah, yeah there's the mistake. Okay. Don't worry, everybody. We predicted that. Yeah, tie on this game, too. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like he might have got a DC or something like that. Um, yeah. Seems to be some technical difficulties. I think we've all been there, you know, playing on a European server all the way down at the Work. bottom of Africa. Oh, he's back there. He's back. Maybe he had to reset his router. I wonder if... Yo, Brian, that was a reset router. <laughs> I want that router. We banned Thresh first. Reset. Well, there's the first ban, so... Uh, I guess they gotta just uh, state that so that there's no changes in case yeah. of. Yeah, so we should see a thresh now. It's and then the trundle. Yes. Yeah. Makes sense. Ooh! Oh, the thresh band, damn! So that for me tells me that they looking to still go something like a karma support. Oh, yeah, a perk comp for sure. Yeah. they trying to avoid the hard engage, I suppose. But I mean, Nautilus is also quite a. Or is a possibility for that hard engage. I mean, yeah. he's almost the same as Trish. Yeah. Come on, I okay, so two jungle bands. It's gonna be. Do we see support? Bond? I think it's Do gonna be see? a support. Oh, yep. Yeah. There's the karma. <laughs> good. Good adaptation. But okay. So, how is ATK going to respond to this? That is the question. How is he going? How are they going to change their team comp into that? Uh, yeah, that's. Yeah, I wonder what the alternative bot lane looks like. I'm surprised they banned the syndrome. I was they did very well against it. Yeah, and I mean, it, I feel like it didn't have much of an impact in mm -hmm. the game itself. Maybe just. Syndra as a character or the laning phase was I mean it didn't stop the echo but maybe just the dangers of that scatter the weak oh there's the echo the echo ban okay so Wukong is still available I wonder if ATK picks that up oh set, that's set. okay yeah, yes it's been a while since we've seen set get first pick priority but he was banned by DSG I think last game I wonder so if ATK showing that if you don't ban him they're gonna take him I wonder if they're gonna still pick the Javan on ATK. Oh no, that was on DSG. 
wasn't it? No, ATK had Trigger. No. So DSG, I want to see. I think yeah. they might pick either the Wukong or the Orn. Oh, there's the Javan. Okay, the Javan, yeah. The, I suppose it makes sense to take it away from ATK. You know they're going to take it if it's left open. Yeah, I, I think we might see a top lane in now. I don't think it will be the Orn again. I don't think it had uh, too much of an impact on that last game. I think they might opt for something else. Especially against the set, uh, set's very good against the, there's the Nautilus, yeah, like we were saying earlier. He's exactly the same as Thresh, so, but I don't think well, they're... Well, it's not exactly the same. Oh, obviously, I just mean, no basically the same, but uh, I don't think they'll pick the Orn into the set. Set does well into melee matchups, although, I mean, Orn is tanky. Yeah. And I think that might well be... Everything. Might be to their detriment in terms of Ooh, the. Callista, are we gonna see Callista Tarek? Ooh, that would be with the I set. That, that would be a great one. Listen, <laughs> can't say ooh to everybody. <laughs> well, we haven't seen these guys on any of these champions. These are three brand new picks for ATK. The fiddles. The fiddles okay. Well, the last thing Jarvan wants to do is <laughs> ulti after fiddles is <laughs> Or ulti and then fiddles just ulties into it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, but I, I, there is the interrupt on the Nautilus for the fiddles, so it is only a 1.5 second channeling time though, which yeah. might Let's be see. a little short. Caitlyn? Okay. For the Caitlin range. Nautilus, you play bot lane, what's that lane like? Have you played against that lane or as that lane? It's not too bad, the only thing they really kind of have to... So definitely the Callista's short range in the beginning yeah. is going to be... Punished by the Caitlyn, but uh, the only thing they really have to worry about is like the Nautilus hook and stun into a, a Caitlyn trap. Mm. Um, that's the biggest kind of worry. But other than that, I think the Callista might struggle just because of her short range. It's kind of like a vain matchup. Um, at least she does have a bit of extra mobility to kind of stay away from the Nautilus. So then, do you think they pair? Uh, uh, Something you know that can keep the Callista alive with the Callista. I still think it might the be Tarek. I would ban the Tarek if I was the yeah. If I was them, I would even yeah say that Tarek is a great pick because of the heal. Silas and Silas. Okay. Three mid laners. Sure. Definitely wow. trying to Galio, shut Adia, that Citra, down. Echo, LeBlanc, and Silas. Six mid laners. Oh, okay. I was talking yeah DSG side, but yeah, yeah, no, no. It's going to be, I wonder, the Echo is not open, so I wonder who the mid lane is going to be, but I think the support would be a great pick for the Tarek to keep the Callista just healthy, and then any engage they can just stun and walk away, yeah. basically. Or even it turn it around with the the Ren from the Callista. Yeah, so I'm a little bit surprised to see the Ziggs now. I would have picked the top lane if I was DSG and kept the Ziggs for last week, just to so you don't want to show it, because now, yeah, I mean, you're giving mm. yeah, them a chance to counter. It's a lot of so we Okay, it's a very no. different team comp from what we saw yeah. <laughs> in the first game. It is it's true. Good. I like to see variation. Sign of a good team. If and adjustments. Yeah. I feel like with the, the karma, they, they definitely, I'm sure this is going to be the... Huh? Surely not. Fiddlestick support. Okay. Or Wukong. Or set support, or set support I actually. Know, it's not, it's not it, I think it might actually be the set support, it, you are correct. Then, yeah, yeah. then Callista can throw the set in the way she would. Uh, and then ult somebody. Sense. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, and he has the pullback, which is great with the W, followed yeah. up by the, the, I don't know what it's called, for anyone watching. Okay, <laughs> so this is three games in a row that we've cast, um, you know, in this tournament, where Wukong hasn't been banned. And he's been picked, mm -hmm. and he has a hundred percent win rate so far, and I suspect that's going to continue. Darius though into the Wukong. That. We saw this match. We saw this last night. <laughs> we saw the Darius. Show. Not last night on Tuesday night. We oh, did Tuesday see. Night, yeah. yeah, and the Darius didn't win that lane matchup as so, well. No. So we'll see if this one's any different. Like you say, a hundred percent win rate on the Wukong. Yeah, I'm. I'm actually. I, I was surprised last time to see the Darius. I'm surprised again to see the Darius. Unless he maybe goes all in with an ignite for the lane and he gets an early gank from the Javan, I I don't see him winning out this lane. I think Wukong is just too slippery. I know Darius has a slow and a pullback, but I don't think it's enough to shut him down. What would your answer be to the Wukong though? 
ban him. But besides no, the ban, no, ban him. <laughs> but I, yeah, I, I suppose. Why did they ban the Sandra? Oh, sorry, I'm looking at the wrong side. I mean, the LeBlanc. The LeBlanc and the and the Silas. Silas, I mean, I they maybe yeah. know something we don't know. Possibly. I mean, I'm sure these teams have done their homework on each other. Yeah, we did our homework on the other teams when we played in this league. I think everyone does it. Yeah. Um, but then again, for someone at grandmaster level, uh, as far as I know, that Zoe um, KDO, uh, he he is grandmaster. So you know, I think there's only so many people you can ban <laughs> true. against you know someone at that level. It is true. Yeah, I don't know. It continues to surprise me that Wukong keeps slipping through the cracks, and that was our last pick, Wukong, as well. I'm sure. I, I don't know. I'm almost speechless. On that. Yeah, I think with the uh, adjustments of the Wukong and the double OT with that mini dash from his W definitely makes him, like you say, he's both slippery and almost the perfect engage, if you can yeah. get it right. I mean, with two potential five-man knockups, it's definitely going to be um, a team fight orientated again with the set. If the Wukong gets the knockup and the set were thrown in with the Callista into an ulti onto the, either the Nautilus, Nautilus, Darius, or Jarvan, I mean, I don't think that Caitlyn's going to really go very far. No. Nah. So, but, uh, yeah, we'll see how the mid lane goes. I'm actually kind of looking forward to that mid lane. I think it's going to be interesting. Well, so a lot of poke. Ziggs? Yeah. It's a lot of poke. But there is think, quite a... Well, the problem is it's going to be so difficult to keep an eye on because someone's going to be alive and, and they're going to look away and then just going to be dead, yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> oh, man. But, Playing uh, against Zoe. Ugh. Pain of my existence. And the Fiddlesticks uh, ward or statue definitely going to... Oh, he's passive. Yeah. Ugh. I think that might uh, fool a couple of people, especially with uh, the Wukong. Yeah. But yeah, at least it does show, I mean, uh, as far as I know, it does show wards. Uh, if I'm wrong, correct me. But, um, yeah, I think that is definitely going to help out. I don't know if they're going to be as aggressive as they were in the last one with the Jarvan. We went for the invade. Well, he was Graves yeah, he then. He invaded off Graves was dead, yeah. No, I mean, uh, Graves went in for the invade on the blue. Oh, you, you don't think Javan will invade the Fiddles? Y yes, I don't think that Javan is going to invade the Fiddles this game. I don't yeah. think so. I, I don't see it. I, I probably wouldn't. Yeah. Because um, once Fiddles gets that... Because um, as Javan, you want to engage with your knock-up, but then if you knock, if you use yeah. your knock-up and Fiddle has the life drain, you know you're not going to kill that Fiddle. Yeah. Okay, so we're loading into game two. Uh, let's check out Summoners and... Mastery? Some of the spells. Let's see if there's any um, abnormalities. Ooh, Zoe. Oh, you're ahead of me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Are you talking in the game or just in life? Well, just oh, in the game. Okay. Ignite oh, on set. Snap. Okay. Exhaust on the, the Callista game. again. Oh, I'm not. Okay. Well, I'll talk about it quickly. TP on the top lane. Ghost and Flash on the Darius. Um... Ooh, red one is set up in the tri bush in the bot lane. Oh, wait, you have oh, me. Oh, okay. I'm still no, loading. No, they are. They are just pinging. The I'm still loading. Oh. You're still loading. Oh yep. my goodness. Okay. I don't even know what happens if I can't get into game. Sorry for technical difficulties coming your way. Set has the <laughs> phase <laughs> rush. So okay, can I tell you what? Nothing of significance is happening. Okay. But we have a five-man group from red oh, on the bottom go. of the map, and we have a five-man group from blue on the top of the map, <laughs> and they have run. They are on literally other sides. Yes, I see. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we did fast forward. I'm gonna just slow it down to try to stop. Okay. I'm this on 52 seconds. 54. 50, yes. Okay. We're on exactly yeah. the same. Okay. So we see the recalls on the blue. They did yeah, put so their deep ward. ward. You have two wards in the top lane. And okay. red looks like they're gonna recall. But you see the pink ward that uh, blue put down. I do see it there on the they're back side of red. red. Okay. But so red looks like they're still gonna go. Ooh. 
Okay, wait, the Zix is falling Blue back. Is, yeah, Blue are pinging the red buff, but they're not going to walk here, which I think is the safe choice, yeah, because they Zuri know they have sees the Zix. Oh, wait, oh, wait, here they come. Her, her spear, isn't she? Oh, the ward. Nice. Okay, so they see it. Okay, but Darius uh, did ward their blue, their red, so I mean. Yeah. Okay, let's see. They are going back. Ooh, do they go for the three man gank? Uh, nope, they get spotted no. out. Yeah. No, I, I, if so I was dropping, I would rush back to my red, but I don't think he's going to do that. I think he's just going to take Looks like he's going to go yeah. blue, yeah. So he's obviously not worried about the little counter. Well, uh, yeah, I was going to say, farming. they're just splitting the map. Kind of down the, the middle. Are you uh, watching? Just watch the fiddles, um, how he's jungling. It. He's doing two camps at Ooh, the same time. Yeah, I'm looking at it now. For anyone that wanted to know how to do that. PP. Oh, here comes a gank oh, in pause. the. Uh, okay, <laughs> so we have a pause. <laughs> Where did you think we were getting a gank? In the mid lane, there's a gang coming. Oh, okay, so. Jarvan's on the backside. Mid lane for the red team. The Ziggs has DC'd by the looks of things. I think it's yep. purposeful though, because they had already paused. Well, that's unlucky because yeah, the Javan was there for gang. Well, I mean, he can still go back. The Ziggs isn't too far. He's only by the tower. So if Ziggs just walks down the lane a little, Javan can still come for that gang. Um, yeah, so I think the ha two pauses, I think. Does each team get two pauses? I'm in not this league, that, exactly I think that's how it works. Sure. Play. I would have to check the rules. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, it might be worth just check because I think we might see several pauses throughout the tournament. I mean, I, I think when we played all those years back, almost every single game had to have a pause. I did have the world's worst internet at the time, but <laughs> you know. So yeah, I mean, uh, we can't. There's nothing really different. Oh, can I re rearrange these? I can too. It looks no. like we might be ready to resume shortly. Fiddles mm -hmm. mm. and Javan on the same CS. Caitlyn's up one. Nautilus is up one. <laughs> and Darius yeah. is up one. Ooh. Okay, DST okay. up to a start. Okay. Yep. On pause. There we go. Do we see the There's gank? The he comes forward. Play. We're watching this. Oh, lag oh, spike. <laughs> Okay, okay, wait, we're on 27, here comes, oh, yeah. no, he's no. gonna give up, he's gonna not go to the bot lane, oh, there's a fight on the bot lane, oh, first blood on the first blood. We set, kill. yes, there's okay, a kill. kill, oh, here comes okay, the job, and he's coming down, no but the, set is gonna set. go, the hook, he gets it, oh, the EQ knock up, great, uh, great, yeah. oh, mid lane, He's getting a bit bullied. We will jump back to that uh, fight in the bot lane soon just to catch all this action. Looks like Jarvan's yeah. going back to the mid lane to try to get that gank off uh, that he wanted to. Yeah, okay, let's yeah, see. here he comes. Yeah, there he's, he's going. To, he's he's gonna get. Oh, flash. Oh, flash, and he oh, flash again. Fla double flash. Oh, well, oh my word. Yeah, oh, they ignite yeah. the turnaround. Is he gonna get out? He As heals. He's, flash. he's gonna get out. Oh, unless he does. The Trouble bubble with the war. Ziggs doesn't have any more mana. But there's some damage to heal. Okay, so they're just pushing. I'm gonna jump back to that first kill. Okay. So we see them fighting. Flash suck in from the set. Exhaust out on the Caitlyn with the flash and the rend that eventually gets him. So that was a great first kill. Uh, let me just get back to time. What's the time there? Nothing's happened yet. 3.53. Okay. 5.55. Oh! Dead's gonna... Yes, get a kill. And I think the Nautilus might go down as well. It looks like it. Yeah, he doesn't have flash. One more. So Got arrows. him. There we go. Nice. Okay, so we're on a 4-2 lead here to... Um... Uh, ATK, Darius fighting against the Wukong, he does get the Conqueror stacked oh, with well the thing, he the does get the heal, but he's gonna go he's down, dead. yep. Yeah. And this is why you ban Wukong. <laughs> Here comes a repeat gang from the Javan. I think this is just to try and keep the Caitlyn safe. I don't think, yeah, there's too many wars there, it looks like he's just gonna take Scuttle. Yeah. 
Um, yeah, for everyone. Oh, here comes the fiddlesticks. He does. He will see that the scuttle is taken. Oh, are they going to collapse? Oh, there's the fear. Jock the silent. Have his flash. He has to. EQ. Can he get away? The hook. Oh, can the they hook. turn it around? I don't think they're oh, gonna they're going to. W from the oh that damage on the set. So up, uh, Can Kalissa get the triple? Oh, he's gonna go down. Unlucky. Okay, that collapsed well early from the zigs. Well Just played from the red. Light. Okay, so this is a lot more even early game. Ooh, there's the trouble um, bubble on the zigs. Yeah, the and the cleanse. cleanse. Yeah, nice. Okay, it's a good fight there. I really thought that, especially with Zoe getting that. Um, Redemption from the creep drop. I really thought that they would win that team fight. So yeah, like you say, earlier rotation from the Ziggs. Mm. Very well played from DSG. They're Oof. keeping this game a little bit tighter than the last game was. So he's going for the poke. Smite. Oh, <laughs> good. Uh. <laughs> she, she smites the Ziggs. Unfortunately, he's not a creep, although he's smaller than most creeps. He got away from it though, which was good use of the bomb. But uh, yeah, everyone who's watching. Uh, Send us your predictions. Who do you think? This is definitely a closer game than we had on the first one in the beginning. Um, yeah. Will Wukong keep that 100%? Oh, I'm busy lane. watching the oh, top lane. Okay, Wukong gets out with the dash. Jarvin's yeah. here for the no. gank, but I'm no, most certain he's going to go back. He's just covering. Yeah, Ooh, there's the ulti. Darius is still level 5 though. He's going to ulti again. Here it he comes. Yeah, there's the yes. second activation, the heal. Ooh, the knock up from the Jarvin. Oh, he almost dies. Here comes the oh, fiddles the and play. the shutdown yeah. by the Jarvan. Great work waiting out for the second activation of the yes. OT. The OT yeah. To get that. Uh, bot lane, how's that looking? It's Is also looking a lot closer than last game. Zoe got the trouble bubble, flash down on the Ziggs. OT from and the Ziggs, ignite, Ziggs and it's gonna die. Yep. Oh, bot, uh, bot lane. lane. Yeah, he gets away. out. <laughs> <laughs> so much sure. action, guys. Okay. It's just no, fight no, after wow. fight after fight. We still only have one kill difference between the teams. Um, let's just see item-wise. Caitlyn did get the beer sword. Uh, Callista opted to finish the boots. So there oh, comes the disconnect. DC. Oh, he's back. I think he's having mm. some internet problems. I think... Oh, oh pulls in. yes, so yeah. Nathan, she She's no dead. Flash. She's she dead. Is, oh, she kill is, uh, stolen Norbert. by the set though. No, he's, he's gonna get out. Support. Definitely, yeah. yeah. He's too tanky. Now, that was unlucky. Caitlyn's flash is gonna come up in about three or four seconds. There, it's up. Yeah, yeah. That that's was, crazy. That unlucky. But Good well uh, utilization, yeah. yeah. I'm not sure if they they didn't ping it. So Zoe is. Oh. Trying to oh exhaust yeah. down on the on the sorry no dragon prior this game Darius is definitely doing a lot better against us with Kong um, Ooh, it's pretty close in that health what what uh, the CS is the there's about a seven hundred gold health. lead uh, on the Wukong from that ten CS there bot lane. EQ from the job and hits the fiddlesticks up, stun on the fiddles, What's he's the healing stun? though. Oh, the Q, they Death get the... Fiddles. Oh, oh. he's dead hooked. <laughs> yeah, oh, I would have been... Engage in the top lane, right. hooked from the Wukong, the OT out from the Wukong. He's getting... Oh, he's gonna get it. He's gonna get the kill on the Darius again. Like you said, that Wukong. Definitely. The problem is Darius has nothing, no sort of CC to, to stop the Wukong. Uh, in other oh. words, what you what you maybe want against the Wukong is uh, you know some of that when he ulties, you can stun him in place so that you can't chase you with the Wukong. Give yourself True. a chance to get out of the Wukong and oh. then re-engage when it's done. You're, so you're not first wrong. Drake. Yep, Mountain Drake. PSG. Okay. I will let you know as soon as late. what the next Drake is gonna be. <laughs> so it was uh, running uh, a little in Colonel. the jungle. How do you see? Infernal's our next trade. In the pit, dude. Do you even play League of Legends, bro? Oh, uh, there. Sure. You play jungle. How do you <laughs> not know? No, there's an only a symbol in the top left for everybody who's watching. There's for all those guy. junglers, <laughs> there's a symbol Player in the top left. Who's uh, watching um, they did get Dynasty uh, and I play some, some duo ranked games. And Dynasty sometimes goes...
jungle, and he's the reason I lose all my match my matchups. They get they definitely get... not my fault. Okay, your rant is way over now. <laughs> well, they get two tower plates on the bot lane, and Fiddles is invading that red buff on the other side. Jarvan's gonna go there now, but uh, yeah, oh, there's not much happening. Yeah, Ooh, he's a little. Yeah, here it comes. Oh, 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 so far, oh, and he misses the trouble bubble. Bot lane, are we gonna see some engage? Caitlyn items. It looks like it. Yeah, he has a fight coming out. Oh, Caitlyn's far. Um, She's attacking the, the set. Oh, okay, the rend. Oh, there's the ult. Oh, too close. W. What the R? Yep. No, from um, from set. The W. Yeah. I don't know. The W. Oh, well played. Oh, the return tool from the set. Yep. What a stupid. Ulti just in time, yo. By the Callista. What do we. I don't want chat chat. Objective timers? Oh. Oh, we oh, can't do objective the... timers. There we go. Yeah, now we can see, guys. We can bring it all to you. We can bring you all the action. Time? If you. Bottom left, interface visibility, there's a. the objective timers. Ooh. Yeah, we got this, guys. Oh, so yeah. we got the kill on the, the Ziggs, solo. Let's just jump back. Sorry, we were a little distracted, so we're going to go back to that. Um, okay, there she kills the creep wave, gets the ghost exhaust. Just, yeah, landing those summoner spells, man. And Ziggs' flash just came up now. So, okay, we're uh, time. Oh, yes, I see yeah. it. Oh, yeah, he's going in. Oh, he's back. Okay, what's your time there? Uh, 43, 44, 45, 46. Okay, I'm with uh, you. Wukong taking more plates. Yep. Nothing. Jarvan's there. Let's he's gonna go items. to save it. Uh, I guess the EQ Ooh, knock up. Uh, he doesn't have the OT. Yeah. Oh, can the Wukong yeah, turn he it? Should get this. Yeah. Well, done. Okay. So, Jarvan. Through clutch. Was he um, five for one? Oh, oh flash, hex flash, I think. Right. Oh, there they go. Surrend. Oh, oh that's support for once again. Are they gonna Dude. tower dive it? Oh, oh good turn around. Greedy. Greedy. Yeah. So both supports. Six. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, six in the mid lane. Over the wall, flash. Oh, 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 the prediction on the flash and the Q. He gets it, Jarvan's gonna start the Rift Herald, but it looks like they're oh, gonna go for a dive. Collapse? <laughs> Flash, he gets the trouble bubble. He goes in, oh Q, look goodness. at that. The Federal OT on the backside oh just for the fun of it. <laughs> Team pinging it out for fun. <laughs> ATK well, I, I, uh, quickly, uh, I mean, who who is the ADC and who is the support bot lane? Because I'm very confused. Set I mean, is definitely the ADC. I mean, I think we've been trolled. Yeah, Set is the, the top ADC lane. Ahead. Oh, flash out from the Wukong, and he gets away. I think the only boost for now is just to out Trouble bubble on the Darius. Uh, oh Q. My goodness, oh. That damage. Is he gonna get another one? He's Here comes dead. the Q. Yep, he's dead. Oh, well, Kong okay. goes, Kong he gets the, the LT and... again, nice, yeah. double kill on the top lane, ATK are starting to pull away from this, uh, Riot, what have you done in terms that? of items, we do see Caitlyn has finished that item of uh, Storm Razor. Storm yes, you are correct, uh, so what do you think about that as a first item for Caitlyn? Uh, it's a, not too bad. It sets Good up lane. the hook and stuff. Good oh, lane. yes, I see, I see. Ulti onto fiddle. the Ziggs. Oh, he's dead. Onto the Ziggs. Sorry, I meant, yeah. Dead Ziggs, not a dead foot. Um, yeah, Storm Razors is not a bad item on the Caitlyn. Definitely sets up for the slow, which helps the Nautilus land the hook. Caitlyn. Oh, I Steals it. Yes, yeah, she got it. <laughs> oh, they're coming. Oh, Nautilus wants to go. But uh, Seti's there in the wings yeah. as well. Um, I think Jarvan's just gonna come bot, maybe drop this um, Rift Herald. I think the tower will drop if they do that. Sure. Yes. Yeah. Yes, there I he goes. This is the right play. Look at all these wards in the bot lane. The one, two, three. With the scuttle. Uh, we there have comes the. On the oh, EQ on the fiddle. 
So oh, flash out. Down. Here comes the OT on the fiddle sticks. Um, healing uh, from the Nautilus. Nautilus is dead. Nautilus is TP from, dead. From, the TP from the Wukong. Oh, Zuri on the backside kills the Caitlyn. Set uses oh, his W to get the shield, he's but he's yeah, most he's likely dead. going to die. Dead. Yeah, well played, yeah. No TP on the top lane because Darius takes Ghost and Zuri so yes. there was no answer. Ziggs is trying to he's push this middle lane. Yeah, there's some damage on the pirates, but I don't think it's worth I think it's Ziggs isn't worth gonna get looting. this. But blue oh. side is definitely gonna get bottom for everybody who's watching. Yeah, just like that, we have a almost a. Oh, that's a five and a half up. In the oh, in jungle, right, Ziggs is dead. gonna. Yeah, oh, the Zoe is getting away. Seven, Seven and zero. zero. <laughs> yeah. She's leaving this game in the dust. I still think I I don't know if they would have used their pick, but I I really think that. Um, they get the shouldn't have picked. Uh, they should have picked in the last after seeing uh, who DK were gonna take as their mid laner. Caitlyn's not too but, yeah. far on the CS. Uh, Callista does gold. finish that black cleaver. Yeah, it's gold about a well. 300 gold difference. Yeah, oh my same. Goodness, look at that top lane gold difference. Uh, busy. Oh, yeah, 3,000 once again. Once again on the top lane, that Wukong, I'm telling you, they need to start banning it. Nautilus is just clearing out some wards, we can see some vision over here. Blue has the red side lit mostly. Um, not many wards on the red side, but yeah, Darius clearing out the top lane. I don't think people think they're gonna go for this. They're cu curious, for everybody who's watching, if you're curious about Vision, let me know. Tell no, me. No, if they're curious about Darius cleaning up top lane, <laughs> he's being pinged to go back now. Uh, Sit in the yes, jungle. Callista's in the bot lane, lane by herself Woo! on the oh wrong goodness. side. She's on the wrong side. Can she get the Caitlyn? No ways. No ways. Yeah. No. Midway. It was close. Yeah, I'm there. I'm there. Whoa, OT dead. The action, guys. The action. They're gonna take this mid lane. Wukong flash gonna push. The oh, flash yeah, out OT out. gets. Yo! The damage uh, coming out from the Zoe. That wasn't good. It's disgusting. She's on one item with a lovely dark seal over there. Wukong's in the jungle. Darius is coming to. S oh, tries to get the hook over the wall, but. She's got the redemption. Yeah, she's already got a total of insects of glory. I wonder if she's got Here comes the flash. Oh. Here comes the oh flash. Oh. Oh, Zoe's gonna die. Yeah, Zoe's She gonna got die. the Caitlyn though, but yeah, Zoe's ah, gonna die. A thousand gold shut down for the Nautilus, so Yeah. Yeah, that puts Caitlyn above the above the Callista now. Callista. In gold. Yeah. A four hundred swing on that. Yeah, top um, lane we have yes, a bit of a fight there. Here comes the Jarvan. Oh, he gets the, the Q. Might kill the Darius. Gets out, there's the OT. Oh, Jarvan doesn't have his OT. He goes back yeah. in, OT gets the... To... Oh my goodness, if he gets Can the he take kill. them both? He's gonna... Oh, get it, I but he's please. gonna... Oh, he lives. Please. Please, can you just he lives, guys. Yeah. He lives. Please fix this shit. This is... Uh, Zoe on OT the on the Caitlyn. Oh, he gets him. Nice. Oh, but, sorry. The uh, Ziggs. Yeah, okay. correct. Uh, any objectives? Nope. We got uh, 15 seconds until a Rift Herald again. But unless they take that in relatively quick time, Baron will be coming up in about a minute 12. Um, Dragon's up in 140. But I just think we're going to see pushing this. Oh, Ziggs catches the Nautilus with the trouble bubble. She goes in with the R. Half oh, is out, gone. Oh, there's the EQ oh, from the Jarvan. Oh, she's gonna die. Yeah. yeah. Good, Good play. play. Good play. Darius in the bot lane now. They switched. I think he's tired of dealing with that Wukong. <laughs> Everyone is dealing with Wukong. This gang, bush gank over here. Are they gonna go for it? Oh, there's the ward. And they're gonna clear it Ooh, out. Callista? Yes. Uh, 
uh, ghost to get, to get out. Wukong's taking. Yep, Rift Herald. Yeah. Yeah. Um, if he. He yeah, else is should lane. be able to finish it, hopefully before Baron spawns. Oh, not to just try to hook the <laughs> Yeah, she's so there. We have all been fooled by that before, so... Here all comes the Jarvan. Okay, set, face checked. By just a uh, hit. Jarvan's gonna re EQ. okay. Yeah. Jarvan doesn't have his ult Flash. though. Yeah. Okay, smite, I mean. Away. But that's not the chilling smite, so it's not gonna do any slowing there. Mm -hmm. Wukong is just unanswered in the top lane. Okay, he's just pushing away. He's no. 30 CS ahead. Both these teams want to 4,000. Oh my goodness, Caitlyn. Dead. Oh, Caitlyn just killed herself. That's, oh, that was oh the Ziggs ulti does some damage. Flash out from the Nautilus. Uh, Ward here, yeah, but I'm pretty sure they can't contend this. No, I they think they're gonna leave it. I don't know if you saw what happened to the Caitlyn, but that, that's a feels bad moment. I she didn't see completely, I just saw the Zoe, trouble bubble. So we sent the trouble bubble and it missed, but then she walked into it. Calibered back uh, no, oh. calibered straight into it. There's the Ocean Drake. Uh, top lane, they want to fight the Wukong, but they honestly. Three men, double wards. Uh, another five minutes until another Ocean Drake, but we're still pretty far from Seoul. Yeah. Oh, trouble bubble lands on the Ziggs. Uh, cleanse comes out. So what items are Zoe on? Let's have a look. Oh my goodness, she said that death cap. Yeah, that's gonna be a big spike. Oh. She died, so the dark shield did reset. I see they are pushing in the top lane. Wukong didn't manage to get the Rift Herald before Baron reset it. Oh, okay. So he did waste a bit of time there, but I see Jarvan is getting engaged on. Um... Yes. Yeah, the pro the problem is that Darius is is going to start feeding up. Oh, uh, this Darius is a little oh, overstretched. Oh, Ulti on the yeah. Oh, oh into the uh, set Ulti. Kenny, well. okay, is he going to yeah. go in for the reengage? Yes, the Ulti, Death the EQ. The he is dead. Callista. Ulti from the Caitlyn. Oh, oh my kill? flashes on the wall. They get the Caitlyn oh. and they get the Jarvan. There's the Ulti on the Callista. And that's dead. the kill. Is this going to be the is this end? Uh, there's no creeps. Yeah, top Close lane. Enough. Creeps are coming. There, yeah, yeah, there yeah, they go. Okay. Pushing in the top lane. Fiddles is going to... No, they're not going to finish. Push in the middle, but... I think they no, gonna just going to take an inhibitor. Back off, he's reset. Um, there is not a single ward on the map for red side. But let's see. 1,800. Sure. Two and a half thousand on the on the Zoe. Gonna go back definitely by that death cap. Get that death cap. Um, what do you think our next item is gonna be? Morellos, Landry's, Void Staff. I'm no, we don't have guessing to wait for it. Yeah, she just wants just to finish the soul. Oh uh, yeah, that's true. Okay. Um, Hurricanes for the Callista. So now There's we have the Triforce. I was gonna say, and, and the Death Dance. Death Dance on the Wukong. Hmm. Honestly, I think as long as you don't hold AP. You're fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine with everything. Uh, um, but, uh, what I just wanted to say is Darius. It's uh, it's a pretty bleak game for the Darius at the moment. Yeah, uh, you know, he wanted to finish item. that Black Cleaver or yeah. Trinity Force, but he had to give Here up. Here comes the Callista. Oh, she did get okay. out. Headshot on the. K okay. Flash, Flash out. Hook from the Nautilus. Nautilus should be Sorry, fine. I did I'll interrupt you. Out. Oh. Almost hits the. Uh, Jarvan wants to engage. Yes, onto the fiddles. Okay, flash from the fiddles. fiddles Ulti. The well. Ooh, can they get out? What are you gonna do? If no turn He's around the high. heel, the hook. Oh, dead. No, no, Ulti on the set from the Darius, but that doesn't help. Kills the Callista. Here comes the Zoe. Ow, dead ow, Wukong. Ow, 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 set. Oh, can the yeah, Darius, Darius turn this around? Damage. Can he do it? Oh, dead. I think they're gonna push. Oh. Just mid lane. Or, two. or go yeah. top lane, I suppose, but I think they'll just push to mid lane, most likely. It's five, it's to two deaths in favor of blue team. <laughs> sure. Sorry, you were saying that the Darius yeah, was the trying Darius to just finish the. <laughs> but I mean, the problem is, the only magic business he has is Mervis, and he's dealing with a three item Zoe. A 12 for two just, and eight. Yeah, uh, Creeps are they, pushing they in. They don't there. have a front. Oh, 
Oh, hex flash from the set okay. just for the fun of it. Yeah, oh, Zoe. Oh, yeah, she's oh. gonna die. Oh, the block. The block. What a man. Oh, there's a. <laughs> Zoe's going back in. Oh, and oh, she gets shut, shut down up. from the Q. The greed. The greed. greed. <laughs> the greed. <laughs> We got uh, four to be giving you ten thousand gold ahead and a match up. But we got clinical. what do we have here? Ocean Drake in about forty seconds. Uh, I don't think Ray can contest it, but they might be able to get there before. I don't you. think they need to. I mean, I, well, contest. They, they, can, they might as well. They might. I no, they feel like they should go for it, just to see. Uh, he does get spotted out by the ward here, yeah, and they are. Two in the mid lane. I think they're gonna try for. Nope. nope. Not gonna be able to get it in time, so it's nope. gonna chase the Javan away. Red yeah, team just uh, back off. Three. The Javan's not doing bad. Oh, He's eight for seven. Can he get there? The OT? Yeah, the OT. Nope. Dead. Is Callista gonna use the OT? Nope. Maybe now. Javan goes in, but he's got no backup, he's all by himself. Yeah, dead again. The Ziggs ulti did quite a bit of damage, but here yeah, goes the Callista. Can he get oh, the turn around? He gets the Q, kill. the kill, yeah. Wukong's pushing in What's the mid lane. In the base, Zoe's going to go for the... Oh, he's just taking the tower. Zoe's trying to pick off the Darius, but it doesn't it's seem to be working. Around to yes. see if can get the Darius, Oof. I thought he's going for it. Oh, he's not. Oh, yeah, he he's just tanking for the. Yeah. Oh, my oh he got God. it. Gonna see it. Surely oh, not. This no. might kill Ugh. It's, oh. Making. Uh, I suppose they are quite a <laughs> better head, sir. So. Yeah. It's not yeah, really a desperate place. Ocean's still up. Wukong's pushing top with the creeps. Fiddles looks like he's gonna go for the Ocean Drake. Ooh, turn around. Yep. The EQ out. Fine. Zoe and Wukong are just playing with their <laughs> food almost. Wukong <laughs> well, is. Fiddles is taking the, the ocean. In the game and Still. he has 3,300 more gold than anybody else on red team. He's almost 6,000 more gold than the Darius. EQ from the Javan, but they're not really That's doing anything. Oh, there goes the. Trouble bubble on the Nautilus. Oh my goodness. Oh, three quarters. Wukong kills the Javan. He's gonna get another one. Ulti. Oh, no, he might die. Out. Yep. Oh. Oh, can Darius gonna kill you? No, he's gonna oh. die. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Caitlyn answers though. Oh, Here Caitlin comes the Callista. Oh, she gonna die. Callista yeah. gonna. Oh, Caitlyn's dead. Ooh, Into the Ziggs. She's gonna try it. The She's Ziggs going to go this. down. Okay. Yes. Here comes the real ADC. <laughs> He can just walk up to that territory and hit it. Oh, yeah. Need to. Oh, he he's goes. He's going for the zigs. Oh, he got stunned. <laughs> just wants to annoy them. He's taking okay, that. Uh, finish. Oh, the zigs is healing up. Ulti flash yeah. or oh, flash ulti. Ulti from the the fiddle sticks, but it's not enough. Walk oh. Over the Charvin, and they hang in there. They're hanging. Yeah. In there. By a thread, they top inhibited to come up. So Wukong has his TP, but. The no, there's no wards for him to TP to Ooh. in the base. No. Darius did finish his Triforce, so there oh, is wow. the two okay. item spike there. <laughs> A little late, but <laughs> hey, they're coming back. Um, yeah, there's a 10,000, 9,000 gold difference about. Um, Caitlyn's kind of coming back, she does have the QSS, which does set her back a bit, but she does have that uh, agility cloak. Cloak of Agility, which does help, I think, with the crit. No, sh she needs that uh, QSS because if so, we should be sleeping. Uh, oh, troubles, there uh, goes the Nautilus. Oh, oh, over the wall. Fine. <laughs> He's fine. He would have almost died if the set didn't hit the um, <laughs> blast someone code. Is pinging, someone is pinging from blue into the base. I think it's the uh, Wukong. I wonder if it's the Ziggs. Ach, yeah, the Wukong. Wukong. <laughs> yeah, but Red is the back Oh, okay, there lane. he is. No, he's been seen. That wave will be cleared out. Here comes the ADC in the mid lane. <laughs> the real one or the second one? 
Callista's attacking the inhibitor. Zoe gets a Q on the Darius. Puts him to oh. about oh, three man OT. The QSS. Wukong's just going for the Caitlyn. OT from the Fiddles does set this. Jarvin gets the kill. But he's, here comes the OT here. Really? Are they gonna found to die? Dead. They can't kill the Nexus. Just because of the inhibitors, but this is definitely GG. So they, uh, they toyed with food a bit. It, it was a closer game. Like in the beginning. Game, actually, in the beginning. Yeah, yeah like, uh, you're correct. Quite a good performance from G in the beginning. But uh, yeah, ATK flexing their muscles. Yeah, definitely uh, almost a similar performance than we saw in the game on Tuesday. Um, yeah? Yeah, started out, started out... Started uh, out... Better in the second game. I think the composure was definitely better, and they found some good ganks. But once again, I think the later on into the game, the Wukong just got ahead. Just look at his goal. Just look at his and goal. just yeah, sixteen thousand. Yeah, I see. I mean, Two nine Zoe on thirteen point seven on his own team. I mean, the the Wukong is is just an absolute wrecking ball mm. at the moment from the games that we've seen. Um, like we say, hundred percent win rate. In all four games, uh, there has been no counter. I think we've seen an uh, Urgot played into it, didn't work. We've seen two Dariuses, they didn't work. Can you remember what the what the last pick was? Um, oh, Orn. Yes. Orn in the last game. That that went even, to be fair. So the Orn seemed to be okay. But yeah, I, I, again, I, I mean, the Wukong got the items and then he just snowballs it into the late game. He just... He got that, I think it was a four or five man knockup in the jungle um, by the blue side in the first game. And then he, obviously with the reactivation, he, I think he got another four man knockup and then the Azure was just able to clean out. That's like the team fight is just, it's too, yeah, it's too drastic and just kind of swings the favors into whichever team has that Wukong. Yeah, no, I, I, yeah, I think, but what was the... Oh, I mean, I was sort of surprised. So, I mean, we know Seth is strong, but I was, I didn't expect him to be that impactful as you know in his role of support. I, I mean, think all he had was a was a dead man's plate. Okay, he got the gargoyle stone plate as well. But I mean, with without the damage items, he's still wrecked as well. I th well, I mean that uh, W uh, shield with the two damage in the middle definitely. Yeah. Um, it's it's such a tricky. Uh, gameplay to play against him because he has the cue for the speed up so you yeah. can't really get away from him ever yeah. which is really annoying and I mean Nautilus has the cue away and Caitlyn has the uh, 50 cal caliber net to try and get away but if if, he, if they step like just a little too close then he just sucks them in and that interrupt as well if he, he can get that onto the Caitlyn then there was nothing they could really do with the Callista kind of jumping around with the exhaust um, slowing the Caitlyn. Um, Nautilus isn't the most damage she tank dealer on the bot side. So, yeah, I just think they they didn't really know what to do and the um, set had the phase rush. So, after the third hit and the E, I mean, there was no ways getting away from him. Mm. It was just, uh, and then the dead man's plate on top of that to add even more movement speed with the boots of mobility. It's just, <laughs> it's like a Ramus with a, um, what's that item? Predator. No, or oh, that, and uh, the speed up one. My mind has gone blank. If you was righteous glory. Righteous glory. That's the uh. one. But uh, yeah, I think uh, Darius. Definitely held his own for a bit. Uh, I thought the Javan gank in the top lane was going to bring it back. After the the uh, Wukong ulted for the second time and the Javan ganked and they got the kill, I thought that was going to be the, maybe the turning point, but it just it didn't happen. That TP play in the bot side, I think, set up the Wukong once again. I see. But... Uh, yeah, thanks for joining us once again. Um, anything else you would like to add? <laughs> Nothing. 
No, I mean, this, again, this is, our, this is our first game. Um, or this, this is the first game teams. we've seen of these mm. teams, yeah. So, and of so the Premier again, League. I mean, uh, yeah, I'm not going to draw too many conclusions. Uh, we'll have to see how, how ATK match up against the other guys and how DSG do t against the other guys. I mean, it's possible that these are the top two teams. also possible that the bottom two teams will have to see more. But uh, overall, I, I mean, I think AT ATK, yeah, they, you know, they, they did look the better team. Um, I think some of the individual performances, yeah, maybe maybe a little bit better from ATK side than DSG. Yeah. Uh, I, but I think overall, just their, their, I think what put them ahead is their ability to build um, a composition. I think both their team comps just made a lot more sense, and they were a able to execute on their team comps mm, much okay. better. I, I, I think um, you know both games DSG was were just trying to react. To what um, ATK were putting together, and, and you can't play League of Legends like that. You can't just play reactive. You have to also be proactive sometimes. Yeah, I think maybe the answer, yeah, like you say, to that, uh, DSG might have tried to go for their own comp and kind of set up something that they are familiar with. Like you say, trying not to be reactive and be proactive on that front. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, it's for gonna sure. definitely gonna be an interesting series. Um, Good games. We do have games coming tomorrow night as well. Um, there are two games, unfortunately, at 7 p.m. Uh, we got GG. Uh, we got GG Black. I'll tell you now. We got GG Black um, versus Era Lost Time. That is a Premier League game, 7 okay. p.m. And we have Zags Marshmallows versus Era Eternity, which is a First Division game. Uh, pool A on that, so that is the one that uh, we spectated on AGG Zero th on Tuesday night, so they're part of the same pool. Um, definitely, I think both of them are going to be good games. Um, unfortunately, we'll only be able to bring you one for now. Um, I don't know if we... I think we're just going to have to choose. We might have to, depending on... I don't know if we're going to prioritize Premier or First Division. But, uh, Probably Premier. Most likely Premier. But uh, yeah, let us know which one you would like to see and maybe your predictions. Um, like we said earlier, we don't want to draw too many conclusions. It will be the second game of the Premier League. Um, so I think that might set the tone for the team. The, the, well, maybe after the first week, let's put it at that. All the first week's games normally conclude on the Sunday. Um, so... We should be able to see after the first week how teams are kind of going up against each other and how their performance in the pool might take them throughout the series or the league, I suppose. But, yeah, so catch us again, 7 p.m. tomorrow night, um, bringing you all the action from the VS Gaming League. And, in South uh, Africa. In South Africa, yeah. Us South Africans. But uh, yeah, another good night, and uh, thank you once again for Chicken Boy joining us. He will be there tomorrow night, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, unless he has a life, which <laughs> is unlikely, since the government has decided to make us all stay indoors. So, so yeah, um, that's yeah. Really my excuse. We will be joined once again by Chicken Boy, and uh, I think it's going to be another exciting game. I'm looking forward to it. So mm, yeah, same, yeah, we shall see you tomorrow. Yes. Thank you once again, Bye. and uh, good night.